Welcome to our tech tutorial. Today we're tackling a question that many Node.js developers encounter. Our viewer is looking to replace specific HTML tags in a string using regular expressions. Let's dive into the details of their challenge. Welcome back to another technical video. Today, I'll be going through your question, answering it, and hopefully finding that solution that you need. Guys, remember to stay just a little bit crazy, just like me, and hopefully find that resolution you're looking for. Now, let's continue on to the video. Let's start by understanding the string we want to modify. We have a variable called text to replace that contains HTML-like tags. Our goal is to remove the B class B1 tags from this string using regular expressions in Node.js. In Node.js, we can use the replace method with a regular expression. The regex pattern we need is splice equals B slash G. Now let's implement this in our code. We will call the replace method on text to replace, passing in our regex pattern and an empty string. Finally, let's log the result to see the output. You should see the string without the tags. Let's now look at a user-suggested answer. You can replace strings in Node.js without using regular expressions. A simple jQuery one-liner can help you remove children from an HTML element and return the modified HTML. For a practical example, check out this working fiddle that demonstrates the solution. Let's now look at another user suggested answer. To replace a specific string pattern in Node.js, you can use the replace method with a regular expression. Here's a simple example. Let's now look at another user-suggested answer. To replace strings using regex in Node.js, you can utilize regex capturing groups. The regex pattern you'll need is the engine may G. Here's how you can implement it in your code. First, define the text you want to modify, then apply the replace method with the regex. Remember, using $1 in the replace method will keep the content from the first capturing group intact. And that's it, guys. I hope that's found the answer that you were looking for and you got through to that solution. If you did, please hit the subscribe button. I'd really appreciate it. And until the next time, you have a technical issue, I'll see you. Have a good one.